back. All right. <laughs> I'm not going to say. <laughs> you heard us both say. All right. <laughs> good morning. Welcome to Good Day Tampa Bay. We are celebrating on this Friday. <laughs> All right, Dave, are you going to party with us? <laughs> uh, yeah, absolutely. I'm right behind you. Were you, you guys an start... anchor or a Backstreet Boys? Better get it right. Uh, new kids on the block. <laughs> oh, okay. They're great <laughs> Taking it back to the old school. <laughs> it's so cool. I'm a little bit older. <laughs> Laura, good morning. I feel, I feel like I'm in an episode of The Bachelor. They're, uh, they're handing out roses. They've got a florist here, so they're handing out roses uh, as people leave. Thank you, and thank you for watching and supporting. Oh, I'm sorry. My, 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 my phone just went off and said you were the wind beneath my wings. So I guess you are the wind beneath my wings. I love that. <laughs> I'm putting on my Bumble profile. Hey, Jen. Two things. So random. And you are the wind beneath my wings. <laughs> Siri doesn't know her place. She just wants to talk when she wants to talk. Oh, no, you can't because they're sold out, too. <laughs> Doors open <laughs> at 4 this afternoon. This is going to be huge. 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 So rad. <laughs> the raddest. When is 80s con so Russell and I can go? I'd be down for that, too. Yeah. In a hurry. Or Russell, 70s, <laughs> 70s con. Yes, we're running. Hurry it up. <laughs> we're fading fast. No truth to the rumor that you and Elise are looking for tickets for the private after party. Uh, I feel like Elise is just going to storm the doors. Uh, I don't think she's going to bust through a ticket right. or not. You better watch out. Okay. Uh, outside, it's uh, 80 degrees. <laughs> J-E-T-S. <laughs> it could be fun. Right? Why not? I didn't watch a lot of 90s shows. I was kind of <laughs> grown up at that point. <laughs> For lack of a better term. I was going to say. For gonna... lack of a better term. Okay. So. But <laughs> if the Brady Bunch wants to, you know, head, uh, I'm there. A little Don't house. ever grow little up. Little House on the Prairie? A little House on the Prairie. <gasps> 70s kind. Let's do this. <laughs> we will organize this. <laughs> little House on the Prairie, the Waltons. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't know, he loves that show, by the way. Um... I still can't hear you. Oh. I guess I'm going to give up now. Jason, oh, wait. I heard an all. Oh. I heard a moan. That was me. Is that that you, was Jeff? me. You can hear me. Oh, Hi. I did hear. I hear you now. Okay, good. I was good. talking about you the whole time. How? I'm kidding. You know, I kind of prefer it that way. I'll just do a monologue. Let's just cut her. Uh, I can't hear Jen talk, talk to me. And I, then I can. Comes in early every Monday just to help us out. We every. appreciate that. Oh, boy. <laughs> Oh, yeah. oh, 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 they boy. didn't tell you yet? Okay. Oh, they didn't tell you? Good, okay, good. You're breaking the news. Appreciate it. Big week, big week. Indeed. What's going on? I don't know, nothing. I'm just trying to hype you up for the week. No, big week. Big week. 83 degrees outside. It's going to get dry for two days. I'm all excited about that. Okay. Look at his face. Well, I just didn't know where we were going. Man. No, it's just a big week. <laughs> but we're not going to get a ton over the next few days. It's just going to be kind of quiet. Yeah. You can get a little rain dance. No, you don't want to see me dance. It usually does the opposite. We saw the, the, the start of the NFL first. dance, and that was not pretty. It's no, it, it, we it, saw it, his dancing and at your you wedding. And you saw what happened. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. 79 <laughs> degrees <laughs> outside. Yeah, that are, was... are you taking responsibility for Aaron Rodgers? Is that, is that what's no, going on? No, no, I just think that, you know, <laughs> before I was born, I just think that I, I missed that gene that said dance. Yeah, you know, I was, like, eating crackers or doing something different <laughs> or something because I missed that gene. 79 degrees outside. That's the gene for other stuff, too. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you glad I'm back? 416 and 79 degrees outside. Let's just go. I'm done. I'm done talking to him. There is a lot on the chopping block. <laughs> a lot of the chopping block here, too. <laughs> it fell off the chopping block. <laughs> Everything from special events to charity donations. It wasn't me. That's all I got to say. And people's jobs are gone, too. Uh, Foster Teens Brian Harrison is live in this story for us. Uh, what, what did Dave knock down in there, guys? Did Dave knock something down? What? <laughs> it was Dave. It we're going to blame right, it on gonna, Dave. We're going to blame it on Dave. We're going to get this train. We're gonna, let's blame it on Dave. Let's get this train back on the tracks. Okay, yeah. The job of the practice squad is to simulate the coming week's opponent and better prepare the team for the game. You're looking at the practice squad, huh? Senior year, I was practice squad at JV. Most of the men actually say that they do think about the Roman Empire, but why? Some say men inherently have the need to conquer, and others say that there's uh, always been a fascination with the empire's influence on modern civilization. Simpler explanation, these men know that they're being filmed with a bizarre question, so they come up with a bizarre answer. Exactly. Could be students of Stoic philosophy and study Roman culture every day. 
plausible scenario. It, it, it could, yes, it could very well be. I'm just saying. How often do you think of the Roman Empire? Well, I do read Stoic philosophy every day, so yeah. Do you think about it when you when you yes, stand in the newsroom stand like, like this? That. That's me. <laughs> Caesar. <laughs> <laughs> Beware of the eyes of March. <laughs> yeah. There's that. You. <laughs> that would be you. Okay. A2, Walter. <laughs> oh, man. Let's move on. She just sold all of them for a staggering amount of money. Kind of feeling that one there. Yeah, I was, wasn't that? You were all into it. <laughs> Welcome to the 7 o'clock hour of Good Day Tampa Bay. I'm Laura Moody. And I'm Russell Rhodes. You're going to hear me roar. Hey, Dave. Well, then roar then. Roar. Oh. Everybody out there okay? <laughs> How scary. 701 is 79 degrees out. It's okay. I so hard. <laughs> <laughs> Who on the Lightning has a number 20 Nick sweater? Paul. It's Nick Paul day. <laughs> 20 days. Okay. I'm going to play, play it cool. <clears throat> Since when? Why start now? <laughs> I'm 17 excited. years. My palms are sweating. Let's see what's happening, Mr. Chuck. I'll, we'll do it. We got yeah. it. We got it. We can do that for you. <laughs> yeah, we're going to go to Yeah, you want to do that? Yeah, let's do that. Let's get over to Charlie Belcher right now. <laughs> Charlie? Yes? Hi. Hi, what's going on? Uh, we don't good. know. Good we question. don't know. Good question. Okay, I know what I'm doing. Okay, you, then right. you go. Well, I know what I'm doing. I got this. See now the conspiracy part. Watch it. Part Watch of it one me, more time. The conspiracy part of me says where the mouth is, there could be a secret entrance to the mountain. Oh, aliens put it. There. That's a Lord of the Rings Hobbit thing that I picked up. My bad. <laughs> He's not even touching that. Don't have pressure. No, I was thinking about, so, was thinking about <laughs> some weird Nicolas Cage movie. You're <laughs> looking for <laughs> l l l the National Treasure yeah, movie. Yeah, You're looking yeah, for the key. That's where it's hidden. That's where yeah. it's hidden. Hopeful it will be available stateside soon. Hmm. Fungi-based protein. Hmm. Cook it and use a lot of that girl's ketchup on it. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to take a lot of ketchup to get that down. Ew. <laughs> I don't know. And I'm wiggling my feet under here. Getting Why? excited for the weekend. Yeah. You are. Oh, yeah. You are wiggling your feet. <laughs> hey, Dave. Hey, guys. What are you doing over there? Very I'm doing some work over work. here. I'm, I'm, it's a Thursday. We're excited. Watch yourself. You we kidding? got temperatures in the 70s. <laughs> I am I'm putting together a full football world. Not, not at all. <laughs> We're doing it. Most people hit the peak of happiness at age 70. 70? Got a long way to go to find happy. I'd probably, I'd probably say I'm the most happy and content that I am, I've ever been right now. Oh, I love that. Yeah. That's wonderful. Because I don't care what anybody... <laughs> anybody thinks anymore. <laughs> True. Well, Dave always says I'm an old soul. Maybe I'm a 70-year-old trapped in a 40-year-old body. I do not share that opinion of Detroit's airport. Really? I had to sprint from one end. It's like one long terminal. I had a stroller, and I had to sprint from one end to the other. Anybody else want to play the violin for him, too? Welcome to oh. what everybody does. <laughs> you got to do what my mom does, play the smallest violin. <laughs> mom, but thanks for that. With your Herculean athletic body, you made it in plenty of time, right? With this Herculean body, I'm going to dive at your knee. <laughs> <laughs> a new study suggests a common sweetener may be bad for your brain. We'll have the details coming up next. Uh, you got nothing to lose. <laughs> 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 Took me a second, which proves your statement. <laughs> Love you, mean it. Wish you brought the crown, by the way. Oh. I wanted to see you in the crown, but I know. Yes, I know. We, we just bring it in on possibly morning, bringing please. it in. You have to try it on, though, when you come to the house. <laughs> you know, Dave wants to. Oh, well, wants of course to he does. Sure, fair enough. Dave, should I bring it in for you? Absolutely. <laughs> But guess what we can do for Jen, Elise? Guess what we can do for Jen? What's that? We can crown her Miss Kombucha today. Absolutely. So she can have yes. her own little crown. And to <laughs> cherish that, we're going to buy some and pour it over her head because that's what you do <laughs> when you win that title. I don't know if the hairnet will help for that. Uh, use those speakers to call for help. Just say, call for help, and you'll be automatically connected with 911 dispatchers. And I can call you immediately, too. <laughs> just, just in the blue or when you fall down? All the time. <laughs> on standby. I uh, need you on standby okay. all the time. And I know you would come get me if I fell down. I would. <laughs> See you later, I, I might take a stop off at Wawa first, but then, yeah. Stop off for Juji Fruit. <laughs> I've had so much kombucha this morning. <laughs> I am buzzing around here. I'm like, bzz, 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 bzz. but <laughs> I'm buzzing.
but yes, your gut's yeah. never been healthier. I got a good gut, the best in town, baby. <laughs> best in town, and I love your guts. I love your guts. <laughs> Don't even know what to say now. You know, it's, I mean, <laughs> I will yeah. see you later. <laughs> Cheers to Cheers. Kombucha. Love you. Mean it.